Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can tell, it is a little bit different. Uh, we are going to be diving into an anime, specifically Sailor Moon Crystal. Uh, so it's going to be a review video. I've decided that I'm going to make it into three different parts. So today is going to be the, um, the Dark Kingdom arc, and then next time we're going to be doing the second arc, and then the third arc. Now, I just want to say that these are just my own thoughts uh, and my own opinions. They are no way, shape, or form correct uh, or, you know, I guess the right way because I am not a professional movie slash anime reviewist or critic. Um, so please just take that into consideration. And also, I will be doing the best I can to not spoil uh, any of the anime, especially because I don't know who has or has not seen it. So I'm just going to kind of throw in a little bit, like not too much. So with that being said, let's jump in. Um, so with Sailor Moon Crystal, uh, it starts off with a girl named Tsukino Osagi, uh, and then throughout her journey... Um, through the first uh, season, she actually meets <clears throat> she meets like a little cat named Luna, and then towards that, she starts meeting the other senshis. And then, as the anime goes on, you know, we get to it be uh, we are introduced. Sorry, we are introduced to um, the villains, and then we are introduced to a character named Tuxedo Mask. Uh, for the villains, we are introduced to Queen Barrel, Queen Metalia, uh, Nephrite, Zoisai, Jedi, and Gunsite. And so, during that time, as we are introduced to it, you can you kind of get a little bit of a backstory with them. And then, with Tuxedo Mask, you get a little, little bit of his backstory as well, and how he and Uzaki are kind of connected to each other. So... Overall, it was a really, really good anime. Uh, the first season, definitely, I thought it was really, really good. Uh, I would give it, like, um, a 5 out of 5. So, although there were scenes that I actually did not expect. Um, if you guys have watched the video, or, uh, I'm sorry, if you guys have watched the anime, uh, then you then you will know. Uh, and if not, like I said, I'm not going to spoil for you. I would recommend you guys watch it yourself. I will have the website to where I have watched it. And yeah, so definitely it was not expecting that. Although I will say that some of the things I didn't really like about it was that we could not, I mean, sorry, we, we could not, we didn't really give too much of a backstory to... The villain side, although I wish they kind of did dive into a little bit of the characters. Like, not like they did, but I just kind of wish they put a little bit more detail into the um, into the villains. Like, how they were, uh, how they became the villains that they did, uh, what happened um, in their story as well. So, like I said, overall, I really, really enjoyed it. Um, the music, the writing, the acting was really good. By the way, can we talk about the music? Like, I, for those who have watched it, I don't know if you guys can agree with me on this, but when I saw the when I heard the music along with the acting, uh, there were parts where I just completely cried my eyes out. Like I was crying like waves and waves of tears. And for those who know me. Uh, you will know that I'm a pretty sensitive person. Um, I cry over, I, I don't cry over like the smallest things. I'm a lot better now, but I am pretty sensitive. So <laughs> when I, and I'm a pretty big crier too. So when I cry, I cry. Not like little small tears. No, I'm talking about like, like I said earlier, waves and waves of tears that just come down. So yeah. Anyways, uh, that's going to be it for today's video. It's a little bit shorter, <clears throat> but like I said, I didn't want to spoil 
the anime. I didn't want to go too into it just because I did. Like I said, I don't know who has and has not seen it yet. Um, I would actually recommend you guys watching it uh, just to give it a shot. So also, uh, let me know if uh, if you guys have ever seen this anime before, and also let me know uh, which anime you guys would like me to review next. Cause I'm act. Uh, I just started recently getting into anime. Um, the only reason why I started with Sailor Moon was because uh, I've heard of Sailor Moon, the, uh, the original series. So that's how I am familiar with Crystal, <clears throat> which is actually a lot different than the original one. So yeah, uh, let me know your guys' thoughts on it. Have you seen it? Have you not seen it? And yeah, let me know um, which anime you guys would want me to review next. I'm really interested in getting more into it. Alright guys, thank you so much. Bye.